Okay, so finally it's here. We're going to do these last two looks, um, or nail designs, I should say, and then we're done with all the different nail looks, or designs, whatever you want to call them. I keep on wanting to say nail look, but it's a nail design. <laughs> um, so these are the last two nail designs I'm going to do, and then eventually I'll have the winter ones up soon. Um, these are a bunch of nice short little videos for you guys, and I hope you guys have been enjoying them, and including my mess ups and all. Um, and I hope these are helpful and give you a lot of ideas for Christmas and Thanksgiving coming up. Um, so I'm going to just jump into this uh, tutorial right now. Um, so we're going to start with the present, and I'm going to have the red down already, and I'm just going to take a green and make a little box with the green. If it's not perfect, that's okay. We're not we're not here to be perfect. We're here to enjoy ourselves and you know learn how to do something new. So I'm just doing a nice thicker coat of green so that it shows up well. And you get that nice vibrant color. Okay, there's your green box. Now I'm going to take the gold. Actually, for this one, I'm going to take the silver just so you can see the difference in how it looks. Um, that one has a gold bow on it, but all you're going to do is take the glitter, and do the silver this time, and just dab it down the middle. It's a little thicker, so it should go on top of the color, even though it's um, the color's wet. Okay, and you're just going to make... Um, a little X. It's a little thick because um, I'm putting it over top of the color right away, but that's fine. And then you can just make these little bows up top. And then you have a nice little present. Um, a silver and a gold one. So the last thing I'm going to do for you um, after the little presents that you did is going to be this icicle look because um, I love the color blue so I want to incorporate it into Christmas time because you do have the icicle lights that you hang from the trees um, and everything so um, figured I <coughs> excuse me figured I'd add those in um, and oh where did it go Sorry guys, I'm just trying to get my pen. Um, so yeah, so we're going to do that um, That look there. I might add some more Christmas looks later. Because um, I just came up with an idea now. But anyways, I'll probably cut all that out again. Anyways, if I may leave all these bloopers in. I'm just kind of in a talkative random mood. And I'm tired, but let's get on with the show. So what you're going to do for this is take the white and do a thick, basically like a French nail on the top. And this you do want to be thick because we're going to take a toothpick. And we're going to try to start dragging the white down to kind of outline where all the icicles are going to fall. And this, again, it's supposed to be like a dripping water, which is never in a specific way. So it's okay if it's a little sloppy. And you're just going to take your um, toothpick and just drag it down. Drag down the white. Okay, and you're going to run out of white, so just keep on dabbing white up top and then dragging it down. Down 
here. Okay, so now we just got a little bit of a design going. We're actually going to go in with our brush. And um, I'm going to start on this side here. Hope you guys can see me. And I'm going to brush a diagonal line up. Now you actually got a little bit on the other one, but we're just going to brush a diagonal line up. Oops, let me get product on there. So we're going to draw this diagonal line up. And I know I hit the other nail on that one, but that's okay. Not too worried about it. Because normally if you do this, um, you'll be doing these all at once, not different times. So if you get a little white on the other one, you can just blend it into the other nail um, and do the silver last. So just take the lines they kind of gave you and use it to draw your little icicles with your brush. And it's going to be kind of rounded off, but that's okay. Because I've never seen a perfectly triangular pointed um, icicle before. So it's okay if these are a little rounded off and not pointed at the end. Um, you're just going to take your brush and lightly drag it up to get these little shapes. And I'm sorry if any swear words you hear in the background. My boyfriend's playing his video game. And that's what happens. Um, so there we go. Let me just... Got a little white on my present, but that's okay. There. You have that. Just a bunch of little white lines that you made. They don't have to be perfect. Now all we're going to do for this is take the silver again and just draw some lines over top. And it kind of gives it the glisten of the snow. And when the light hits it, so... You can, I'm put, again, I'm putting everything on a little heavier than I started, just to see the difference, for you guys to see the difference, if you like it heavier or not, or if you don't like the glitter, or just, you know, kind of figure out what you guys like. Um, you can do a few, just drops throughout, just to kind of give the bottom a little shimmer. And there you have it, you have your icicles. It's a very simple, easy look, and it looks really pretty on your nails. And I hope you guys enjoyed all these tutorials. Like I said, I'll try to get the winter ones up soon. But for now, these are the last of the nails. You got all your Thanksgiving and your Christmas nails here. I'm going to have people in the down bar. Um, there are links to their webs uh, their channels, uh, shops in the down bar, and, you know, just some really good... Um, information in the down bar for you guys to check out. Um, it hasn't really changed much in a while, but it doesn't mean that it has lost its quality and how good thing the links are. So go check them all out. And I hope you guys enjoyed my little present and um, icicle tutorial. And in fact, all my nail tutorials. Um, I welcome comments and criticism so I know what to perfect. Just keep your criticism nice, even if it's not... If you didn't like it, say it nicely um, so everyone can enjoy. And I hope this helped a lot of people out. So I'll talk to you all later. And thank you again for watching my videos. And I really, really hope you guys liked all the different nail ideas I came up for you. I uh, came up with for you guys. And um, yeah, so I'm just, I thank you so much. And I'll try to get the other ones up for you in the vampire look. Uh, it means a lot to me that you guys watch my videos. And I can't wait to have a chance to do more for you and to hear from you guys. So I will talk to you later, and thanks again for watching. Bye, guys.